Hello and welcome back to Low Hanging Reviews. Hope everybody's been doing well since the last post that we've had. I know it's been about two weeks, but I assure you that I have been busy working on the set as well as other projects on my personal time. As you all know, Halloween is close approaching, and I've pretty much been setting up for that. If you can't tell by the set behind me, threw up some lights, threw up some festive things, and we're going to see where we can take it from there. Aside from that, I'm going to go ahead and throw out some information that I think is pretty important to know that's going to happen over these next upcoming weeks. First off, I'm going to be talking about my Twitter, which uh, I just started for this channel. And of course, it's under Low Hanging Reviews. As of right now, there really isn't anything on there, and I do need to get more active. Um, I will post shorter things and maybe some comments and some private stuff so I can chat with some people, and we'll see what happens from there. So one of the major reasons why we didn't have a video for about two weeks um, is because I came off of that pretty long double feature video, which, you know, I don't think a lot of people saw. They probably didn't want to sit there for about 30 minutes and watch that, but that's fine. You can always go back and watch it, and not a big deal. But uh, getting back to it, we haven't had a video because I was busy making this thing. Now, um, for Halloween this year, we decided to go with it. We're just making this guy right here, plus the body, which I don't have on camera, but I will go ahead and show you guys throughout the season. And uh, I still need to pop the wig on this head. It's made out of paper mache and plaster with some acrylic paint, some clay teeth, and some eyes that hopefully will glow when everything is all said and done. We also went ahead and made a Georgie and a paper boat. And um, again, like I said, I'll go ahead and show you guys that when it's closer to being done. Initially, the project was supposed to only take me one week, but then I had to dedicate two weeks to it, and now it's two weeks and two days, which it is what it is. However, it's almost done, and I can just put it past me, we'll stick it out in the yard, and I'll be able to continue doing these episodes. And that brings me to my next topic, which is for the month of October, we're gonna have something here, and it's gonna be our first special for the holiday of Halloween. I've decided to call this special in October, the LHR 10 Days of Halloween, which we're going to be taking a look exclusively at Halloween-themed items that I picked up at stores around the area. Theming of the show will be entirely different. Obviously, the set is, you know, dressed for the occasion. Not only that, the logos, the intro, and the music will all be changed. At the end of every episode, I will be telling a short story that I found on the internet, and hopefully that can add a little bit to the charm of the special. So in total, that'll be 10 days of reviews of Halloween-themed products, as well as 10 short stories, and maybe I'll include some of the stories I had in my life that were a little bit strange and mysterious. In regards to those stories, I may or may not be illustrating some things loosely for the stories. I'm not really too sure what I'm going to throw up while they're being told, but, you know, I don't want you guys to be bored and just watch me sit here and tell a story. Other than that, I really don't want to drag this out for too long. This is just a short thing, just letting you know that I have not gone anywhere, these videos are not stopping, and I just was prepping for these 10 days of Halloween. By the way, they're starting from the 22nd all the way to the 31st of October, and um, that's what we're looking at. With all that said, what are your plans for Halloween? If you are doing something or not doing anything or you do something that's unusual, go ahead and leave a comment in the comment section and I'll try to get back to you if ever there is a comment in the comment section. With that being said, have a happy Halloween season or if you don't celebrate it, still have a great October and I'll see you guys during the 10 days of Halloween special. Until then... Have a great start. Ugly night, give you chills. It's not the cold breeze. Oh, geez, it must be Friday the 13th. Know what that means? Anywhere could be a crime scene. But if you're quiet enough, bet you can hear the night scream. Who's that presence feared more than Michael? Having everybody in the game run for survival. Boy, he's tactics, need no practice. Slashing through all you fools, even taking your jewels. And yes, it's true. Anywhere you step ain't safe. Even Houdini would admit that he couldn't escape.